Hello guys and welcome back to another Disney Heroes Battle Mode video and in today's video we're going to be talking about the Hero Chip Bundle and now I like to do videos on these ones because these are the best bundles that you can buy like because obviously we're looking at 2100 gems right and if we were to buy a diamond crate 10 of them 2590 and 90% of the time, if you guys follow my channel, you will know how unlucky I am. 90% of the time, when you buy one of these diamond crates, um, I get nothing. So if you are thinking about buying a diamond crate, and then all of a sudden the one of these deals pop up, so for example, Heroes 1, which is what I'm talking about now, I'd recommend getting this instead of buying the diamond crates, because these are so much better, so much nicer. And you're obviously you're guaranteed to get 50. And if you open the diamond crate and actually got them, you'd probably only get like 12 or 7. So straight away, these deals are so much better than all of the other ones. Because you know what you're getting. So the issue when you buy a diamond crate is that you're, you're down to luck. And I don't know if the diamond crate actually tells you the odds. I'm pretty sure they have to now, yeah. Because it was um, ever since the CSGO like palava happened with all the crates and all the bits and the pieces and the and that it's illegal to not show the odds in your games now. So, we have a look here. Badge drops. So, full blue or full purple, which is annoying because they put them both in one. So, they're technically not saying the odds there, but you've got a 28.8% chance to get a um, badge drop. And then hero chip. You've got a 32% chance to get a hero chip. Chip. That could mean one, so just remember that. You've got 32% chance to get a hero chip apart from the monthly signings, the guild crates, or VIP. So you can't get anyone good. Full hero at 20%, credits 12% and XP drinks 6. And the only annoying thing is, oh no, the credits aren't too bad because you get 50,000. And the XP drinks, mega or turbo, eh. if you don't get a mega one, it, it's a bit pointless to be fair. Now buy 10... Buy 10 guarantees one of the 10 drops to be a full hero. If the hero is one you already own, you'll earn 7, 18, or 30. And also, you can't get, you can only get heroes as they come, which is annoying. So if you were to get Woody, you get 7, because he's a, he came as a 1 star. If you were to get Baymax, you get 30. There's no, like, difference. You just get what they are. And then the buy 10, like I just said, is the same, but you're guaranteed a hero. And obviously, I believe you can probably see the odds for most of the crates, yeah. But obviously, these ones aren't as bad because you're not spending real money, it just needs to show them. So, it's only a 20% chance for a hero when you do it. The hero chip goes up by 4% when you do it by 5, which isn't too bad. And it'll be, this, it'll be the same for all the crates you can see here. But you know, they're not fussy. The only ones you really need to fuss about are the VIP, not the VIP because... The VIP crate, two of the six drops are guaranteed to be heroes, one of the two drops are guaranteed to be a featured hero, the other drops are going to be hero chips, XP drinks or credits. Now, I'm getting close to getting the VIP crate, I'm getting very close, I'm just shimming my way there, slowly and slowly, every day, I'm just slowly getting towards it. Oh, look at the defences I've done. So I'm just slowly creeping towards that crate. It's just a quick video guys, thank you for watching. Click the top link in my description to join my Discord and also follow me on Instagram. You'll see all the behind the scenes stuff there. I'll talk to you guys in a bit, see you in the next one.